Well, we're going to have an extra credit quiz on Unit 11A, and this is a model of that extra credit quiz problem, the actual uh, problem. Uh, for that actual problem, I'll change uh, the numbers. <clears throat> so let's answer this, and by the way, we're going to use uh, this sheet, which is uh, in that uh, section, Unit 11A, in this table, and this equation is also defined in that Unit 11A in the book and on the uh, notes that I provided, emailed to you. So, <clears throat> it says, use the exponential growth law to find the frequency of the note a fifth above middle C. Well, this fifth above, let's get that straightened out. If you notice, there's a, a second, a third, a fourth, a fifth, and a fifth doesn't not does not correspond to five half steps. You have to count out the number of half steps above middle C, for example. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So any time uh, you're uh, told to go a fifth above some note, that may, corresponds to he seven half steps. So, uh, then also n in this uh, equation, n represents the number of half steps. So, th for this particular time around, we've got c is, uh, middle c is, has 260 cycles per second. We're going to times 1.05946, and we went seven half steps, so n equals seven, so seven goes in the exponent position. And when we run that through a calculator and round, we get 390 cycles per second. Now let's do b. So Q equals, and again B, the note one octave and a fifth above middle C. So we're going to go 260 times 1.05946. And then the issue is, well, we're going a fifth above, so that's seven half steps, and an octave is 12 half steps, so when we add 12 and 7 together, we get 19. So n is 19 in this case, and when we run that through the calculator, we get 779 cycles per second. <clears throat> so for C, Q equals, and it says, and the note 2 octaves and a fifth above middle C. So middle C has a cycle of 260 cycles per second, or a frequency of 260 cycles per second, times 1.05946. And in this case, we went seven half steps above because we went a fifth above, so that corresponds to seven half steps. And we went two cycles, excuse me, uh, two octaves. Well, there's 12 half steps in an octave, so we went two octaves. We went 24 half steps plus 7 is 31. 24 plus 7, 31. And when we run that through the calculator, we get 1,558 cycles per second. So when you do the, this uh, extra credit quiz, the process is identical to what we've done, except we'll have different n values, and we probably won't be going up a fifth. We'll be going up a second, third, fourth, sixth, or seventh. For example, what if you were going to go up a, a uh, <clears throat> what if you were going to go up a sixth? Well, let's count the number of half steps above, uh, or we're going to go a six above middle C. Let's count the number of half steps 
above middle C. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So if the direction said go a 6 above uh, middle C, then we'd go seven or nine half steps, so n would be nine in that case. And we're done.